Welcome to this brief introduction to Arena 3D and Cytoscape. Arena 3D, or Arena 3D Web as it's correctly called, is a tool for 3D network visualization of multi-layer networks such as this. In these networks, you have multiple node types generally placed in separate layers, which makes multi-layer networks suitable for visualization of multi-omics data. However, one of the main challenges of making such visualizations is that Arena 3D requires quite a lot of data preparation before you can do the visualization, and this typically requires scripting skills of the user. If you want to learn more about the Arena 3D tool, I've already covered that in an earlier presentation. Cytoscape, on the other hand, is a tool for 2D network visualization. It has a graphical user interface that allows you to import data and easily map these to visual properties such as colors. If you want to learn more about the Cytoscape platform, I've also covered that in an earlier presentation. Furthermore, Cytoscape has an ecosystem of hundreds of apps, which allow you to add all kinds of different functionality. One of these is the Cytoscape String app, which allows you to easily import string networks into Cytoscape. And it would therefore be really convenient if there was an easy way to take Cytoscape networks and pass them on to Arena 3D. And that is precisely what the new Arena 3D web app does. It's a Cytoscape app that you install from the App Store, which allows you to send networks from Cytoscape to Arena 3D. This allows you to build a network inside Cytoscape like the one you see on the left, and send it to Arena 3D, visualizing it the way you see on the right. The user interface of the app is very simple and mainly consists of this dialog. The key thing you need to do in this dialog is to define the layers. You do this by selecting a node column from the node table in Cytoscape, and each unique value from this column will become a separate layer in Arena 3D. Moreover, the app retains as many of the visual properties as possible from Cytoscape in Arena 3D. This means that you can import a network into Cytoscape, import your omics data, visualize the data on the network, for example by coloring the nodes, and then do all of this within Cytoscape before passing it on to Arena 3D. The second half of the equation is the Arena 3D Web API. This is what the app talks to. When you send a network from Cytoscape, it is received by Arena 3D Web through its API. Afterwards, a default 3D layout is applied. However, you can use the web-based interface to adjust the 3D layout of the layers relative to each other and apply a 2D layout to each layer. That way, you can create multi-layer network figures like the ones shown here. This is all I have to say about how you can visualize networks from Cytoscape in Arena 3D Web. If you want to learn more about how to visualize networks in 3D, take a look at this presentation next. Thanks for your attention.